honestly, you guys, whenever I hear a couple being married 20, 30 plus years, in my mind, I'm automatically wondering how, you know, what kind of marriage has it really been? It's a beautiful thing to be married that long. However, that's a really long time to be married. So baby, when you ready, hit my line. Tell me what you want to do. I know you still really do, do, do. Hey you guys, before we get into today's video, I just want to take time, as I always do, to thank all of my subscribers. Thank you guys so much for supporting my channel. If you're not already currently subscribed, what are you waiting for? Click that subscribe button right now. Also, I do have another channel called Brandy Be Your Beauty TV. Navigate to the first comment pin to the top to check that out. Also, like the video, you guys. Comment on the video. I want to hear your thoughts, so comment and like. Um, and now let's get into this juicy topic. In today's celebrity couple toxic news, we are talking about Judge Mathis and his wife, Linda Mathis, heading for divorce. In case you are unaware, according to the LA Times, Judge Greg Mathis and his wife, Linda Yvette Mathis, are parting ways after almost four decades together. Linda Mathis filed for divorce from the Judge Mathis star Thursday in Los Angeles County Superior Court, citing irreconcilable differences as the reason for the split, according to court documents reviewed by the Times. In the filing, she listed their date of separation as July 17th and noted that they have no minor children. She also applied for spousal support while asking that the court waive her husband's right to request support from her. It is unclear whether the couple had a prenuptial, prenuptial agreement in place. She also requested that Judge Mathis cover her legal fees. Representatives for both parties did not reply immediately Friday to the Times request for the comment. The college sweethearts wed in 1985, more than a decade before the premiere of Judge Mathis, which ran for 24 seasons from September 13, 1999 to May 25, 2023. Here's how people are reacting to this news. Someone says this, divorce, nah, you took four decades of my life, go sit down. Someone else said, listen, Linda, listen, ain't nothing out here, y'all gone to counseling, y'all gone to counseling and work that out. Someone else said, peace over everything. Someone else said this, Dang, 39 years, come on, we can live in separate rooms, ain't nobody leaving after 39 years. Someone else said, the majority of us are too young and inexperienced to even genuinely relate to this kind of union or separation. Can you imagine the depth of range, the depth and range of issues two people could have after being together for 39 years? Most of us won't experience partnership that lasts even half as long. They've raised their children, helped each other grow. This isn't a loss. And at her age, after all those years, I'm certain she's not worried about being in another man's face and just wants peace. Kids and grandbabies, God bless them. Wow, that was a really good one. Someone else said this, my grandparents are separated after 40 plus years of marriage. He had a baby on her, was abusive. She did everything for him and worked herself down for him time and time again and left her with nothing but debt. Earlier this year, she sold everything in her house and dipped out. She never looked back and they have been no contact ever since and she's in her 60s living life more than she ever did. And yes, they were heavily dedicated to the church in those years which always made her stay and work it out. I'm so happy she's finally happy now, however long it took, I'm glad she's free. Finally, others said this, I don't care if we're married three years or 39 years, peace is free. She had to have lost her peace years ago, but tried to hold on. I'd rather be alone and at peace. Mother effers, be wanting you to stay together, unhappy, heck no. 
Someone else said she got the internet making her believe that there's some better man out there for her after 40 years and in her mid 60s. Even the elders aren't safe from all the BS. Majority of people are shocked Judge Mathis' wife would file for divorce after 39 years of marriage. It's unclear the exact reason Linda Mathis decided to file, but according to dndfamily.com, divorce after 30 years is fairly common with a range of reasons from empty nest syndrome, infidelity, or just different interests. Honestly, you guys, whenever I hear a couple being married 20, 30 plus years, in my mind, I'm automatically wondering how, you know, what kind of marriage has it really been? It's a beautiful thing to be married that long. However, that's a really long time to be married and dealing with one person. Marriage is hard work and it takes both people every single day to make it work. I can imagine after 39 years of going through ups and downs, you get tired. It's easy to judge this situation, but what people don't realize is that your emotions and feelings just don't shut off at a certain age. I think peace is worth more than staying together for other people and for an image. And for the people saying there ain't nothing out there for women in their 60s, lies okay the feeling of wanting companionship doesn't stop at a certain age you guys miss linda can certainly find love again at her age not to mention she is very very beautiful now i did do a little bit of digging linda posted her and her husband back in may of this year she posted a series of photos that included her husband with a caption that said this. Craig and I had so much fun at the Sugar Ray Leonard Foundation's 13th annual Big Fighters Big Cause Charity Boxing Night. The night was filled with fights, food, and an auction. Always great to see and support friends. Judge Mathis posted he and his wife in June of this year along with other photos with this caption. Guess who's back? Detroit celebrated the reopening of Michigan Central, a landmark event with an all-star concert of Detroiters. Linda and I had a great time watching our city shine. Now, something major must have happened after that because Linda filed for divorce July 17th and they were all smiles just a few months ago. And now Linda wants a divorce. To me, this indicates that she may have found out about something that has prompted this divorce but sometimes a picture is just a picture and literally means nothing again as as i said before we cannot judge these people they've put in their time and effort for a long time and now they are exhausted so it'll be interesting to see if we'll ever find out what was actually the problem Anyways, what did you guys think of today's celebrity couple toxic video? Do you think Judge Mathis and his wife, Linda, simply should work things out because they are too old to divorce? Leave a comment. Be sure to like the video and share it. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Hi guys. Don't forget to click that subscribe button. It lets me know you're enjoying the content I'm creating for you. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.